I love peoples. This is Banner Knights, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. In the last episode, we finished up the Earth Temple for why it is named Nobody Knows. We think Nintendo was just trying to be unnecessarily different, and then we got told off by some ninja bitch who was very mean to us when all we tried to do was save our best friend Zelda, and our who was also our childhood friend. She made Link feel very bad for himself, and so he ate a tub of ice cream last night, so he may look a little chubby right now. Please don't talk about it, he is very sensitive about his weight. Now I do not know what the frick I am doing, so I am going to continue with my normal commentary now. I'm sorry if you could not understand me this entire time. One moment guys. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Gotta like clog up my nose so much. Yeah. <laughs> Hey guys, I love people, this is Ben and Knights, and welcome back to another episode of Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Uh, I don't know why I felt the need to say that again, because basically everything was said by that weird nasally robot voice. How I, how that's a nasally voice when I was completely not breathing or using my nose at all. Excuse me, jeez. During that entire segment, I don't know. But anyway guys, uh, in today's episode, we're going to be continuing on. Here in Skyloft, or in the above the cloud region, I should say. Uh, oh, wrong one. Nah. Uh, we're gonna be con continuing on, and actually, we're gonna be collecting a lot of these chests that are out here. Uh, let's see, there's the one out here. I'll get these three while I'm here, actually. So, no. Oh, that was close. Uh, let's see, now. Not exactly sure where I have to go. It's like one's there, one's there, one's there. Okay, I guess that kind of leads. There is one little thing I show you. So we're getting a little bit of side stuff done in this episode while we're kind of collecting all these goddess cubes. I'm only getting this high altitude so I can get some extra speed here. Uh, so now we get to head to this light tower, lighthouse looking place that we saw before that reminded me so much of Wind Waker in the way that the islands are all grayed out until you kind of come near them. And you see, it's this nice little hut with all these trees coming back. It's the bamboo forest! It's Kaguya! Or... Was it Kaguya, or...? Crap, I'm trying to remember the bamboo girl's name, like... It was from... Well, I don't want to give any spoilers for that game, guys. If you haven't played Okami, go play it. I, just, I swear, just go play it. Uh... Oh, crap. Am I gonna, I'm gonna regret this, aren't I? Yes! Oh, no, no, no. Ah! No! Why did I do that? God dang it, I even said to myself I was gonna go and do something else first. Oh man. I'm an idiot. Well. Come on, should I leave that in or should I actually. Nah, it's a couple hundred rubies. It doesn't take a whole long time to get that. Ugh! Okay, now I'm very angry again. I finally calmed down after last episode and the freaking ninja lady... Bruh. I want to call her name again, but I'm trying to be nice about it. Uh, uh. I lost like... Alright, hold on guys. Time to my pot! Space time rewind. Hey guys, you saw absol absolutely nothing. Nothing happened at all. Um, nothing out of the ordinary. Uh, yeah, nothing happened. Ever, everything's fine. And no, yeah, we didn't. There was there was no mess up with the chest. I don't know what you guys are talking about. There's there's nothing of the sort. How can you guys even be so so crude just to even assume that with me? No, I would never do something like that. No, I would I would never. Just reset even an LP episode in the name of money. Oh my god, what do you guys think I am? Jeez, and I I could just hear all the comments Kim's gonna be making as I'm saying all this. <laughs> anyway, guys, uh, ignoring that very particular fail, I actually landed right where I wanted to go. No, I didn't. Well, yeah, I landed where I wanted to go, but actually, I'm not gonna do anything in here. God, I. I need to get my bearings straight. Wow, this episode is just coming off to a great start, isn't it, guys? 
at least we got a cool camera angle. Anyway, what I wanted to do... Jump down here. Like that. Send down the rope. Oop, it's behind me. There we go. And guys, let's go see Beetle. Whee! This would be like the coolest way... This is this be like the coolest way... God, my voice cracked right there. This would be like the coolest way to enter a shop ever. I would, I would so love to enter a shop like this. I'd be scared if it crashed. Hey, speaking of all the gears I was talking about before, wow. You don't really see this place from this angle much. I mean, look, it's like auto angle right there. Okay, I'm gonna stop that. It actually does look like two different scenes, though, right there when you do that. Jeez, oh, ah! Okay, now the camera's freaking me out. How you gave a lock onto him. Anyway, hey, Beetle, uh. Actually, a couple things I want to pick up here. Um. Actually, you know what? I'll grab this for now because I'm gonna grab it eventually. It's a life medal. It bestows a bunch of mysterious and mystical effects on whoever carries it. What kind of effects? Don't ask me. I, I don't actually know. You should find out for yourself. And yet, he's selling it for extremely high price, despite the fact that he apparently doesn't know what it does. Now, guys, actually, if you have this in your inventory, uh, basically what it does, it adds one extra heart container to your total hearts. So, yeah, guys, you can only get 18 total hearts in this game. I... <laughs> I don't know why I said that, I'm just gonna leave that out or something. But yeah, you basically that'll help. Oh, thank you ever so much. You've given me the strength to keep pedaling. Uh, no, I don't think I could actually afford this. Yeah, it's 300 right now. Now, I can't afford it at the moment. But you know what, actually, while we're here, so I can't get that at the moment. This, I believe, is still 100. Yep, okay, I can afford this, so guys, we are now poor again. Hopefully we don't need anything. Oh crap, we actually might. So, we now have all the extra wallets in the game. Thank you! Um... Yeah, I guess it's gonna come up eventually, so... Yeah, basically what I was saying, the the heart metal, it basically adds, it adds to your total hearts. Uh... Uh, just, but you have to actually have a space for it in your adventure pouch. But don't worry about that, guys. Um, so now in this, now that freaking all that stuff is empty now. Can we make it to the end? Can we make it to the end? Can we make it to the end? Yes. Now, we can go and freaking find all these chests. Oh, jeez, and I think there was one actually on Skyloft that I could have gotten. But whatever, I'll get that on my way back. Uh, since we're over this way anyway, I'll get the farther one. Now, which island that's on, I think I remember. I'm not sure if you could actually get this one right now, actually. There are a few of the goddess chests that we've unlocked that we actually don't have access to, guys, so far, guys, believe it or not. Come on. <laughs> she, like, barely glided into that. Eh, uh, which island's it on? Okay, it's just over this way. Is it this one? Yes, it is. Like I said, can we reach in here? I don't believe so. I'll try it, but maybe not. Oh, yep, actually we can. Oh, I'm sorry, Birdie! Jeez. Because as you guys can see, there's actually another one in there, but... Like, vines there. I don't know what we could do about that now. I was wondering if it was going to be that one, but... Yeah, you'll see some of these... What the hell? Oh, it's a grass. <laughs> you'll see some of these, uh... Islands. Ooh, small seed satchel. Nice. Uh, you'll see actually that some of these islands, even the smaller ones like this, have an extra, uh, have another goddess chest there. So it's kind of useful. I mean, this game reminds me so much of the Wind Waker in, in the terms of like you have this vast open area to explore. Uh, there's a couple up and ups, up us, ups and downs. That whoa. I was readjusting my Wii Remote and kind of went berserk there. Uh, hello, guys. Uh, basically, what I was saying is, um, well, it's got some ups and downs to the whole Wind Waker thing. 
Uh, the downs actually being the fact that there aren't nearly as many islands in this as there are in Wind Waker for you to explore. There are still quite a lot, but a lot of these islands are just... Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay. Wasn't expecting that, but okay. Um... Oh, jeez, come on. Now, you guys will want to watch out for those tornadoes, because trust me, those things are actually closer than they look. Uh, they'll get you pretty quickly if you don't turn in time. Hello. Um... Yeah, all I was saying is a lot of these are just like these portal rock things. Uh, rocks with octa rocks. Uh, or just random stones floating out here. Which is really cool. It adds for a lot of atmosphere and stuff. But at least in Wind Waker, I like the hell in Wind Waker there were actually islands that were completely optional. You didn't, they didn't really hold anything too significant. You could just visit for the hell of it. It made the game have a lot more atmosphere and feel a lot more alive in that sense. And now finally, uh, we're at this island that we've never been to before. No, you guys have never seen this. All of my viewers that are claiming to have seen this island before, unless you played the game, you're lying. <laughs> oh, I wonder what's gonna be in this chest. I wonder, I wonder, I have no idea. <gasps> a gold ruby! It's worth a staggering 300 rubies. Oh my god, I'm so surprised. Okay, let's just shut up now. <laughs> hey guys, we head into here in this bamboo forest looking place. Oop, who the heck is this? Uh, dude, your epidermis, Sean. Quite a bit much. Whoa, is that you, Beta? Never thought I'd run into you here. Who are you? <laughs> Aw. Wait, tell me you don't know who I am? Believe it or not, I used to be the most popular guy in the sky. Mr. Skyloft, that was me. So it's like a Miss USA pageant. <laughs> but you might relate better if I told you I was the, pr I was the proud father of Skyloft's most popular girl, Beatrice, princess of the item check. Okay, do with that what you want. Do without what you will. How's that? Does that clear anything up for you, young feller? Ha 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 ha. This here's my secret spot where I come to work out the kinks in my sword arm. There was a time when I was the most popular guy in all of Scalif. Yeah, you said that right. Folks were always cheering me on like like it was a parade. But as you know, time passes. And I'm not the young buck I used to be. I eat when I get stressed. I'm all worried about my darling daughter all the time. I mean, look at this belly. <laughs> yeah, if that's because of you worrying about your daughter, then you must worry a lot. So that's what drives a feller here to chop some bamboo. Let me tell you, there's no better way to sweat off those pounds. Uh, apparently it's not working too well. Sorry, dude. Here's an idea, man. Why don't you try slicing some bamboo? Uh, sure. Yeah. That's the spirit. Chop away, boy. Hold up a second. Get your horse sold. <laughs> Get your horse sold. There's got to be a way to spice up and spice things up a notch, three. Yep, that's the ticket right there. No, oh, jeez, I have a bad feeling about this. You're gonna take a swing at whittling down that. Big old bamboo that right there in the middle of the room. Thing is, see, it's a contest to see how many cuts you can make before it hits the ground. If you're good enough, you'll start out here with a prize. I'll cost you 10 rubies to see what you're made of. You want to give it a try? Wait, I have... <laughs> not free. I think if you say not free, he actually won't charge you the first time. Uh... No, I'll try it. You gotta be pulling my leg. I'll tell you there's a prize on the table. You think I'll do that for just for popularity's sake? How am I gonna put food on my table if I let you play it for free? It's bamboo, you don't own it. I think. If my family could eat popularity, they'd be stuffed full all the time, but they can't. What do say? One... Fine, I'm in. Well, it looks like I was wrong. Alright then, get to slicing. Now guys, what he means by touch the ground is just like the whole thing actually falls over, I believe. But, you'll see that in a moment. Ah, probably could have done that a bit better. Um, I think my record for this is around 31, maybe. So a little higher than this, but it's really hard to get. Most of the time, I reach the top of the bamboo before I even get that high. Let's count those cuts. Your score this time is 26. Uh. Hoo-wee! That's what I'm talking about. You really brutalized that bamboo, boy. Here's your prize. What do we get? What do we get? Oh, we got a monster horn. This well crafted horn is made of sturdy animal bone. You might find a use for this as a material. I believe that's actually our first one. Uh, there is actually a way of gathering those, just like any other one later on, guys. But I want to see you do 28 chops next time. Come back whenever you feel like you might want to chisel up that sword arm. Yeah, I believe uh, at 28 and higher, you get like a, a better price, like a rare treasure. I don't know if you can actually practice. Oh yeah, you can actually. 
Hopefully he decimated that. Uh, you know what, I'll try this one more time, even though I probably shouldn't and I gotta get moving. But, alright, man, get to slice. I'm probably gonna do worse on this time, guys, just letting you know. Whoa, 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 whoa! You're not lighting any records on fire with that score, son. You gotta get at least 15 cuts. Sharpen up, sharpen up your concentration. There's no price for sloppy slicing. Mm. Well, look at that. I take a gander. Things it's clear you got yourself a stubby, stubby little sword. You're mighty well considering that. I only got 10 this time. How's that mighty well? The longer the sword you got, the easier it is to sip through that bamboo like a loaf of warm butter. A loaf of warm butter. What? Dude, I think that belly is more than just eating random things. Get yourself a longer blade in the future, come back and try again. Be surprised what a little extra steel can do for your chopping score. It's the fact of that thing moving off to the side. At least you got a katana. Uh, you know, I would try again just because I don't want to leave it at that, but I'm on a time limit here, guys. So, on to the next island. What say you? Yeah. Off we go. But yeah, you do get better prizes for that. I think if you get at least 15, but you don't beat your initial score. Uh, I believe you just get rubies or something like that, and as you can see, he's actually now on the map. Clean Cut. I guess that's the name of the game. Name of the game, Clean Cut. So, we got about two or three other goddess... Uh... Goddess chests we can get while we're down here. So, let's try it. I don't know why I'm going in this, actually, because my... My stop is right here. Ooh. That works. Uh... Or does it? Wait, is this the right now? Yeah, this is the right... Oh. You know what I think it is, guys? I think this is the one I was saying that is one of the ones that you actually can't get. Uh, okay, that's actually good to know. Um. I... Nope. Just had to jump to a different part. <sighs> there is another one, I believe, inside the actual place. But you can't get that for now. But anyway, we got a silver ruby. A whopping 100 rubies. 1,000 rubies. 1 trillion rubies. Anyway. Eh. I believe the next one is this island way the hell up here. Oh, can we make it from here? I doesn't look... Oh, I think I'm tiring on my bird. I'm sorry, Brady. Uh, I, What? What? So no one, wow, I got a huge upward momentum there. Aha! Ready, I'm sorry. Wait, this isn't the one? Oh, it's gotta be... Oh, I guess it's this one down here. All right. Oh, yeah, I remember this one. This is the one... Isn't this the one where, like, NCS timed the descent? I'm not gonna time the descent, guys, but... Let's see how long this takes me. I don't know, I'll, I may put a timer up there, if not, I'll just put up the actual time it came out to be. But, uh... <laughs> I don't know why I did that, but... Um... Oh, no, no! Nice. <laughs> anyway, I believe we just have to climb down this way. Uh, probably shouldn't be doing this so much due to my stamina, but okay, we actually made it. Nice. You got the thing. Ooh, a treasure medal. Treasure will appear more often. It's perfect thing to take along on the treasure hunt. But the patch is full. Now, actually, guys, uh, oh, jeez, don't do it again. Uh, the treasure medal. If you actually have that in your pouch and you just and you defeat enemies, I believe it makes more rubies appear. Uh, or no, actually, I think there was might have been a different medal for that. I don't know. It either makes more rubies appear or something like that. Or uh, what it does is... 
Uh, it makes like tr actual treasure from them, like treasures such as uh, like the monster claw and stuff like that. Ooh. Uh, actually appear more often. Um, you may want to set out. Uh, I'll try and get back to you on that by the next episode. And okay, we can't actually open this one yet. Is this lead anywhere? Or is this just gonna lead back to that same chest, just in a different direction? No, this one actually doesn't lead anywhere. Okay, so we know where another chest is later. We just can't get it now. Anyways, I believe that was the last one out here. So for an episode that's probably gonna be very long. Uh, I'll meet you guys over in Skyloft. Link, you know what that means. Tell them apart! Okay, and I am back here. And now, let's see? I believe, yep. We got another one, and that is actually not in the bazaar. Oh. I want it! Uh, okay guys, that's actually another one that we can get. So there's at least two uh, that we know of that we cannot yet receive. Which kind of sucks. Uh, you know, this is a long episode, so I'm probably gonna go and check this out. I don't really think that there's anything we can particularly do in here. Hello? Hi. Hey, welcome to the item check. Oh, it's you again. You've been coming by a lot recently. You're pretty much the only one who comes by regularly, actually. Hey, wait a second. I don't suppose... You don't come by here just to see me, do you? <laughs> what are you supposed to say in a situation like this? Uh, yes, it's true. What? Really? Yeah, right. You think I'm gonna fall for that old line? But, if it were true, that might be kinda nice. Oh, I almost forgot. I still have a job to do. Do you have some for me to hold on to? Yes, please. Actually, there are a few things I'd like to move around. Alright, let's see it. Uh, I'll bring my bottles with me. Um. Oh, yeah, I need to go buy that other pouch from Beetle. Uh, for now... Oh, no! I don't know I'm used to, like, A and B to move stuff around. I don't know what... What? Why am I thinking A and B? Uh, anyway. Uh, I hit you back. Anyway, I will be moving my iron shield out and placing it here with my wooden shield. Yay! Uh, yeah, for now, I think that'll do. Uh, guys, this will, this will actually protect us from electricity, which the iron shield will not. And the area we're going to next will actually need that. And now we can't get that chest yet. You guys, I think for now, we'll call us a day uh, in the next episode. I don't believe there's any side stuff that we need to do now, actually, that's unlocked between Elden and Lanairu. So in the next episode, we'll basically be... We'll basically be going on and... Putting in the stone tablet in the Chamber of the Sword. Uh, checking if there's any optional stuff we could do. Uh, if there is, we'll be doing that next time. And hopefully heading off to the desert. So until then, guys, this has been Beta Knights for Let's Play Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. I hope you enjoyed today's episode, and I'll catch you all next time. Have a good night, y'all. Bye-bye.